Okay, boys, today we're going to uh, practice introduction to heading, um, and in particular, um, attacking style heading, okay? So let's move into the drill over here. We'll have four on the outside, four on the inside, and the inside players with the balls. And very simply, what we're going to do, okay, is just going to have one foot forward, and just knock it down, and always be ready. Plant the other foot forward, and always be on the ready. Okay, off you go. Always alternating the feet. All right, now let's make sure when we do this that our eyes always open and we hit the middle of the forehead, okay? And our mouths are closed, okay? We firm up the neck and we thrust from the waist, okay? Always on the ready, let's see a couple times. Good, firm up the neck, thrust from the waist, okay? Let me see how you do that. Good, firm up that neck, well done. All right, now that you understand that, what we're going to do is a little bit of movement and now that the air is going to be coming, the uh, ball is going to be coming in the air, okay? So ball on the outside. Okay, yeah, and knock it back. Come back again, other foot forward, knock it back. Foot forward, knock it back, okay? Do five and then switch, go ahead. <coughs> Good, always on the ready. Good, change your feet forward. All right, and hold it there. Okay, so what we're seeing here, boys, we wanna make sure when we attack the ball, can I have that? Okay, that we're not back here. We want to make sure that we're attacking the ball so the body is vertical at impact, okay? Ensuring that we, from the waist, we reach back and we knock that forward, okay? Let me see how you do it here, AJ. That's better. Okay, everybody else, go ahead. Good, hit a little more ahead of you. Good, good. Okay, ball's on the outside. Now we're going to add a little bit of movement. If I can just take your place, AJ. Yep. Okay, so all we're going to do is we're going to come in, just up into the air, knock it back, and I'm going to go to the next one. Come through the gates, knock it back, and we're just gonna continue around, okay? A Little bit of movement, there's no jumping yet, just off the ground, ensure that you come in with different feet all the time, okay? Off you go. Good, through the gates, good. That's much better, AJ, good, hit it ahead of you. Good, keep that mouth closed, Devin. Well done. Good, and we'll rotate the other way. So you're gonna come out and go the opposite direction now, a little different angle. Good, and hold it there. Good, so if we're going to be developing attacking heading, okay, where do you think, where do you think we need to head that ball? Right, down to the ground, okay? So just like it, when the goalkeeper's in net, that's probably one of the most difficult uh, shots to save, okay? So we're gonna do the same, same orientation. Now the guys on the outside, take an extra step backwards, okay, take an extra step back, so I can come in, yeah, and we'll just knock it down and we continue on, okay? So make sure we're observing vertical at the point of impact, you're knocking it down. Off you go. Okay. <coughs> well done, Devin. Keep your arms out for balance, not down by your side, Devin. Keep them out a little bit. Good, Patrick. So now what we're looking for, take an extra step back on the outside, and now we're going to get off the ground. Okay, so you're going to nice gentle toss up. You're going to judge the flight of the ball and we're going to come in, okay? Go ahead, approach it, just throw a little bit higher so I can judge the flight of the ball and we're going to attack it, okay? Keep your arms up for balance, go ahead. Good. <coughs> well done. Judge the flight of the ball. Good, well done, Devin. Okay, so the next 30 seconds, Want to see how many times are you able to knock that ball down before you can catch it, okay? So toss it up. Can we knock it down uh, before it bounces into his hands, okay? 30 seconds, see how many you can do. Go ahead. Come on, bounce it down. That's it. Good. Can you spank the ball down? Spank it down. Come on. Judge that better. Come on, AJ. Readjust your feet. Readjust your feet. Okay, outside guys in, inside out. Well, the grassroots handbook, um, we've omitted the heading portion from the six to nine, but we've added it from the 10 to 12 uh, for a couple of reasons. Uh, primarily, uh, the ball doesn't get off the ground much at those ages, um, but also um, as they mature, um, their muscles, their tendons and their bones, um, is probably not the wisest thing uh, to incorporate a heavy ball. Um, however, I think uh, there's 
there could be a missed opportunity if, if the players don't get acquainted with the ball at an early age, um, learning the technique so they get comfortable with it at, an early, at a later age. Um, and some of the ideas they can, they can use even with the balloon, uh, maybe progress to a light rubber ball, um, or even a, a volleyball, something that is very light, or even just very simply just showing the, the, the technique. But I think it's very important to have a, an actual ball so they get acquainted with the ball. Um, and some of the points that we brought out today, um, as far as judging um, the flight of the ball, uh, judging the contact points on the ball um, are all things that uh, we could take an opportunity at the early ages to implement.